Hi guys, I'm Ji. So welcome back to my channel. And today I'll be doing a Taiwan budget haul video. As you can see, all the clothes behind me, I actually segregated them properly based on where I bought the clothes from, like the location. Yeah, that's actually an effort because usually I don't really bother. But anyway, I realized that majority of the clothes that I bought are pretty cheap or in another word affordable yeah that's because i'm a cheap skater i just felt that i should just share with you guys my budget haul from taiwan and yeah let's just move on to the video all right first of all i got all of these clothes ready oh my socks dropped okay anyway the first batch of clothes were from where is it were from Wufengbu Wholesale Market If I'm not wrong, they are known for selling very cheap and affordable clothes It's a must go for people like me that's actually a cheap skate Yep, that's me So the first thing that I got from the wholesale market is this furry turtleneck mesh top or maybe a dress I don't know, I think it's a top but I got this for like 100 Taipei only that's really really cheap for not a very bad material because it's actually very furry and very soft I actually like this material a lot and the material also uh, depends on the weather ladder. I'm not sure if this is actually suitable for Singapore but maybe if you wear it for a movie that should be fine and I think it's also pretty sexy and cute I love this Next, I got this sweater very very simple but the reason why I got this is because this very cute embroidered cartoon character Yeah, it's so cute And I got this for 100 Taipei also The inside material is okay It's actually one of my favourite material Like inside is Mao Mao one But the outside one is like so so long um, After one wash, there's like this furry furry thing that come off It's not smooth anymore But okay lah Because the colour that I bought is in black so it's not very obvious Yeah, overall I'll give this a thumbs up Next up, I also bought this white smocked off-shoulder top And the reason why I bought it is because of the smocked design I got this for 200 Taipei So it's actually pretty cheap Overall, not so bad Next up, I got this brown off-shoulder top also With this tie Not sure if it's for the neck or for for the waist, but maybe it's for the waist but whatever, there's always a way to do with this uh, I got this for 200 Taipei also and the material is very soft it's like chiffon kind of material I think it's pretty good and then I also bought a few socks I can't really remember how much I bought this for if I'm not wrong, it's maybe 50 Taipei so I got like Xiao Kui, La Bi Xiao Xing and plain socks I just bought it because of the design Because it's super cute, oh my god Hi, so cute! Next up, I also got this skirt It's like a very simple gridded kind of bandage skirt But the material is actually very thin I bought this for 150 Taipei For such design and such material 150 Taipei is actually very cheap Next up, from the same location but it's another bunch of clothes also So I'm gonna start off with these A very simple kind of low waist leg shorts The material is actually not very bad It's actually quite soft and smooth Not like the typical kind of denim that it's pretty rough like just very uncomfortable on your skin Then the other one I got from the same shop is these uh, uh, ripped jeans Denim ripped jeans And there's this mini slit over here And the material is also pretty good I like the design And good thing is it actually fit me pretty well Because I'm actually pretty petite So for me to find bottoms that is meant for my size It's actually very very hard And I'm actually very glad that I managed to find some bottoms in Taiwan that actually fit me pretty well Moving on, I also got this white colour ripped jeans I got all of these 3 sets of jeans for 667 Taipei Which is very very affordable and worth it <sighs> This is just what happened when you're too short Next up, I got some skirts First of all, it's this white button up denim skirts I think it's very cute I just like it because it's button up and they have like a shorts inside So I don't need to wear a safety shorts underneath very convenient for me the next skirt i got is this lace denim skirts 
with these two non-functional zip. I can't put anything. It's just like for decoration. But this is definitely functional. And then they also have like a safety shot inside. Yay. So I got both of these scots for 750 Thai B. Not as cheap as the three sets of jeans that I got, but I would say it's actually pretty affordable. It's pretty satisfying when you get to buy something cheap and affordable with a very high quality material. Okay, anyway, let's cut the crap. Let's move on to the next piece of clothes. This is very simple white graphic tee. I bought this size in M, so it's meant to be a bit more oversized fitting to me. Because why not? I like oversized anyway. Uh, actually, I got four sets of this, but the other two I already gave it to my friend. But I still have one more, which is this one. This is Xia Si Bao Bao. The one in white is this Xiang Hao Hao Fang Jia. Okay, so I got four sets of this graphic tee which cost me 800 Thai B. Each of them cost 200 Thai B. Yeah, pretty cheap and pretty affordable. The material is actually not that bad. Okay, so that sums up my first batch from Ufeng Bu Kuxiao Market. Okay, the next batch of clothes is from Shilin Night Market. It's not a lot lah, but I think it's okay lah. It's just three sets of clothes. Yeah, I didn't buy a lot from there. So the first thing that I got was this bright red roam crop top with uh, white stripes at the sleeve area. I think it's very cute and a bit unique. This material is also pretty good. It's very soft and smooth. I also got this white crop jacket. So these two pockets here is actually functional. And there's a checkered design at the sleeve area also, which is actually very nice. I got both of these for 850 Thai B. I think it's actually pretty affordable for a very high quality material and a very unique kind of design and the next one is this black off shoulder top with a buckle design over here and I got this for 190 Thai only which is very cheap I also got this pair of shoes uh, originally it's not that sparkly and nice it's actually a very very plain black shoe without this additional design here because I actually DIY it myself at first when I got this right I felt that it's actually okay but after I pay the money and I try it again when I reach Singapore I realized that it looks like a China ancient kind of school shoe so I felt that I should just add some sparkles to it and I think it's like it turned out pretty nice. <laughs> I actually did a video on this but I'm not sure if I should actually upload this video. So comment down in the comment section below if you think that I should actually upload that video. If you're gonna find this kind of simple basic shoe right, it would cost at least 390 Thai B. But I managed to find this for 200 Thai B which is pretty cheap and pretty great deal. Okay, so this is the end of my batch number 2 from Shilin Market. And then the next one is actually just one set of clothes. I got this from uh, Simon Ting Night Market. It's a very basic kind of blue striped dress. Actually very nice. There's a matching hooded cardigan to pair up with the dress. Very simple blue cardigan actually. Color match perfectly well. The material is actually soft. Can feel how comfy it is without even trying it. I got this for 450 Thai B. I think it's actually pretty affordable for like a jacket plus a dress together. I think this is the last night market that I went and it's from Tan Sui. I got this Super, super nice and elegant jumpsuit. I died the moment I saw this and I felt that I really, really need to buy this. Even though at that point in time, I was actually pretty broke already. Yeah, but I just spent my last few penny on this jumpsuit. <laughs> Just gonna show you. So it's very, it's a very simple jumpsuit, but it just looks very nice. I don't know why. Maybe it's me. The top is very simple. Then what I like is actually the elastic part, which is this part, and then the rest of it is just like a very simple, plain, long jumpsuit. There's two side pockets here, which I can put some shit here. <laughs> That's good. And guess what? The length fit me just nice, except for one thing. Literally, just one thing. It's actually the top part here because the armhole is too big that I can't even fit into it properly. 
everything is fine it's just the top part it's a bit too loose on me so I'm just super disappointed and super sad <laughs> and it's actually pretty pricey I would say there's also like a second layer inside these pants it's actually this one so there's like two layer the material is actually very nice it's also like a chiffon kind of material it's just that it's too big on me I'm actually very very sad I think I got this for 890 Thai B, which is very expensive about $25 I really can't remember yeah but I know that it cost me a huge sum of money $25 <laughs> it's really nice though but yeah you know what I'm just gonna alter it so that I can fit into it I really like this jumpsuit a lot let's put the set thing aside <laughs> And move on. Okay, so now this is actually the last set of clothes that I got from Tan Sui. I got this very simple white crop top and this black crop top. Nothing special, very simple, but I just think that I kind of like the cutting. I managed to find these two sets of top at a very very cheap price and that cost me 300 Thai B for two sets of this top. It's a very 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 great deal man The top is actually padded So for girls who hate wearing bra it's, very, it's a good thing for you because you don't need to wear bra But guess what guys I noticed one thing after I actually tried on this top I realized there's a hole here So this sums up my affordable budget Taiwan haul And I hope you guys like it and enjoy this And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video